The borough gears up again to test more people after it discovered another small number of cases of the South African variant of COVID in the borough. So this is phase two of our surge testing. We want people in the next month right across the borough to have uh, as many people take tests as, as can so that we can again find where positive cases are, get them tested for the South African variant. So that is the code for your yeah. test. Three weeks ago, Ealing was one of three London councils doing surge testing after a case of the South African variant was discovered. It did door-to-door -door testing, as well as using pop-up centres. Ealing was alongside Haringey and Merton in that first wave. Since then, cases have been found and extra testing ordered in Broxbourne and Woking, in Lambeth and Croydon, and in High Wycombe and Redbridge. But so far, no boroughs have had any results back from their earlier surge testing. Despite ordering the testing as a matter of urgency, the health authorities haven't revealed the results. We've been given promises that there are uh, urgent efforts to speed up the uh, return of those test results, and as yet we've 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 not seen them come back. So you know we've been asking for for some time for them, and it is uh, more than frustrating. But uh, hopefully we'll get them soon, and, and people will know. Meanwhile, the testing and the cleaning down will continue. Carl Mercer, BBC Long. Well, Public Health England and the Department of Health have told us that results of the surge testing will be published in due course.